Yeah, it's funny. Like if you go back 17 years, back then people would take a meeting because they were intrigued by the concept of what is this data analytics that you guys want to talk about. And you fast forward to today and, and we've got CEOs of major organisations wanting to talk to us about data because every company needs a data strategy. And that's been a fascinating ride to be a part of. Um, to go from a novelty to something that's caught at almost every business in the world has been amazing. Yeah, I'm, I'm not seeing it slow down. I'm not seeing, I'm seeing it broaden, but the areas and the, the development is still at such an early phase that large parts of businesses haven't really um, fully changed. And so that is, is something that will be exciting you know, for the next 17 years. Yeah, I think the other thing that really interests me is like the range of people that we get to work with. If you think about 17 years ago when we started the business, we were largely employing people that look like ourselves. Whereas today we've got a team that's full of, we've got futurists, we've got software engineers, we've got actuaries, we've got designers, we've got all sorts of different people within our business. And then outside of the business, we also work with a really diverse set of clients as well, from senior stakeholders through to all of those similar sorts of folks. So again, that makes it really energising to come to work and work with different people. Yep. Uh, and because you can learn something of every one of those people. So I remember when we first spoke, you know, we would speak to some uh, person who was on the side of a business who had no you know, great role. Yeah. Whereas now we see there's the CDO, the chief data officer, the chief analytics officer. These guys are reporting to the, you know, to the head of the business. And so the profile of analytics and the profile of what it can do has changed, you know, remarkably. 17 years ago when we we're having these conversations, it was almost like we were playing that role of, what the chief data officer will be today. We would be taking the ideas to typically business owners within a company to say, here's how you could use analytics. And that was obviously really interesting. But today, companies have realized how, how important it is. So they now have these very senior roles around chief data officers and so, and so on that report often to the CEO. And so now we're having conversations with those folks as well as the business. But it does show how much and the importance of analytics has transformed in the last 17 years, I think. I mean, we spoke to CEO Woolies recently, Brad, and I think he said to our team that there's no, there's no area within Woolworths that couldn't be leveraging data analytics to do a better job. And I think that just shows how far the industry has come during that time period. And some of those industries in which there were early adopters like insurance and banking, and we were there in those early days. Like you say, in some areas they were still fairly limited in, in the areas in which they were working, whereas today you know, they're really working across the whole, the whole bank, anywhere where a customer gets touched. I think there's certainly potential to be using data a lot better. I think we were very fortunate because when we started work and we started mostly in the insurance industry, everything had to be done at the customer level. You know, there was customer level pricing and so forth. And so the competencies that we built up there, we were very lucky that we could then transport them into those other industries, into retail, you know, into banking, um, which has then become the theme because you know, most of the organizations as they go down the journey have realized that the key thing they want to do is focus on the customer. So even though it's process, it's process to improve convenience for the customer. Or if it's value, it's, it's trying to work out how you can give more value to one customer because of the shared value they'll give back to you. So all of those things have, have been a big change. Whereas in the past, I think a lot of the businesses were actually thinking about you know, how analytics would benefit them. And now I think they're thinking about how analytics will benefit the customer.